Hey guys, welcome back to Stoneheart. In today's episode, I uh, wanna try to make our blacksmith, and we're also gonna make a weaver because the blacksmith and a weaver are kinda gonna work together. So for that reason, we're gonna make it both of them. And uh, actually, we do have the blacksmith hammer ready, so we just have to give the blacksmith hammer to one of our hardlings. So we're gonna give it to this worker here. So we'll be getting a blacksmith now. It's gonna be well, who was it? What did they pick up up directly? Because it should say that... Um, okay, let's try this again see if it works this time. Where is this person? It's like there's someone who's... Um, not willing to move. So I'm gonna try to make this mining... Yeah, this one works. So I guess Fostan didn't want to become a uh, blacksmith, so it's gonna be Kate instead. Kate Homer. So we got a blacksmith, let's place out our little workshop for it as well. So build a workshop. But I don't know, it might be the reason why it didn't work. I got some really weird error when I started out to save C++ something like that and coding language and uh, might be something that... And this is not normal that we'll say that the workers are split up like this, so it might be some bug going on here, so... So we got this and we can queue up a lot of things. For me, I would say that uh, this is a little bit trickier than uh, Manor of the Other Workshops. Like, it's a little bit trickier to maintain these things. Because if you're gonna make, like, where do we got this ring? The bronze one. I don't know why it's not showing these icons, but for making a bronze, you're gonna need to make copper ingots. And you're also gonna have to make one of these um, tin ingots. So. One tin, one copper makes one bronze ingot. So we're gonna make one... Let's see, by the way. Bronze ingot. So, I mean, we can make some of these. Let's let's make three of these and we can make um, three copper. So we're just gonna start working with our blacksmith. And we do need to get a weaver soon, but... Uh, we're pretty limited on the amount of people we got for the moment, so... One hour and we should have that window frames. I hope we do got them. I really hope. It do seem like we got a lot of windows. Yeah, I think we should be fine. So the blacksmith is now working. You can see here. Get us a lumber. Lumber? Did you need lumber for one of them? Would you use it like as coal? Okay, copper actually need... Okay, they all need one wood. So I guess that's for actually like kind of like smelting it. Something like that instead of coal. Okay, so we're getting some of that going. And after this is done... We're gonna queue up so we can actually make this bronze one. So, I mean, we're gonna make three of these. We made three of the other ones, so... Once they are done, we're gonna be able to make three bronze ingots. Okay, level one, that's good. And as you can see here with our blacksmith as well, we can make tool with this guy. So we can make carpenter's saw, and we can also make a trapper's knife if we need to get one more of these. And we also got some weapons here. So we got an iron pike, we got a bronze maze, we got a bronze sword, we got an iron maze, we got a short sword, and we got a long sword. And we also got these armors, and this is one thing that I'm interested in making. So the bronze breastplate is need four of these bronze ingots, and we also need one bolt of leather and one thread. And that is the reason why we want to have a farmer, um, a weaver. Trade approaches. Uh, if you make me a table for one, I'll be back two days. So I might be able to give you five curtains. Uh, that would be good, but we can skip it for a moment. Wonder if I missed that uh, trader we had before, by the way. I think we did. Yeah, was busy with other things. So, let's see here. I think this person sits still idle. So, what are we gonna do and see if it's gonna work? It might not work. We don't know if it will. We're gonna make a save. And once that's saved, we're just gonna load it up again. And hopefully that is gonna work and make the worker able to work again. Let's see what we got with the people now. So we got something here again. Stoneheart, attempt index feed, listen. The work is still idle. I think this Fostan person is uh, gone somewhere. Not Oh! That explains. Hello, Fostan. <laughs> Standing on the roof. That explains. So let's get a ladder for that guy, so we can get down. Poor fellow. We're gonna get him down soon. Oh, okay, he's making. He's making almost a ladder on himself. So that's good. We got back one guy. 
Did we have the weaver's tool? No, we don't. So we're gonna have to get some resources for making that. So we're gonna grow some silkweed roots, which are used by our weaver. People running away somewhere. What are they doing here? What are they doing? <laughs> Why did they run away there? Okay, let's so get some arrows again. Okay, so let's grow some silkweed. And this is the correct direction, so that's gonna give us a lot of silkweed in a uh, tiny area. Yeah, I think this uh, footman's gonna be enough for this. Got this nice little maze going on. And I think we're gonna make a different shield this time, so... In the previous uh, videos, like two videos ago, we made a shield, but it was like a wooden one. So there is actually a better shield than that one, so we can make that one instead. And I think we're gonna go grow a lot of these because we're gonna need a tons of these if we wanna make good beds, if we wanna make curtains, if we wanna make really a lot of things, we're gonna have to do them. But we might need to get another farmer, so I'm gonna make Foston into a farmer, since we only have one for the moment. And I'm gonna place, um, let's see here, we got two beds, I'm just gonna place two of them. If you saw the previous video, everybody went to the same bed, I don't know how that worked out, but in some way it did, so... I think we can uh, keep digging a little bit more here, like that. Not gonna take too much at the same time, just gonna be way too much work for them to do. I think I will expand this stockpile a little bit once again. It's gonna be no weapons, I don't remember how I put this one. Okay, no weapons here, and no weapons and armor here. And we all, then we're gonna move this, so we have the weapons and armor at a special place, so I'm gonna keep all weapon and armors at this place. We're still keeping all the food at this one. So two farmers, that is definitely gonna speed that up. And hopefully we're gonna meet our daily goal. I think we will, and we might not do it because of the net worth though, so we will see. Which so we should start on a second building, definitely. That that's pretty needed as well. I'm gonna move that. I think it might be a little bit too close. Like that, see, see the daily update? Okay, so we actually got one new, that's great! Beth Hunterton, welcome to West Orchard Wood. And let's see here, we're gonna make this... Um, yes, a little bit different. That's good. I think that's gonna be pretty good. Let's see how this works, will it just... That might... they might not like that one, I w we will see. Oh, it seems to work. And let's get a roof for this one. We're gonna go for a uh, normal wooden roof and this way instead. Let's see, let's raise this a bit. That actually looked pretty good with uh, doing like that, so in the future I might keep making it thinner and thinner. Just to like, you know, try it out, see how it might look so. Maybe we should make a double door for this house. Let's make that. That is something like I never really do. And let's get a window on top there, that could look pretty good. So I guess we're gonna have two windows at that side, and two windows here. And I think we might just have one window on this side. Should we go with two here as well? How did I put the other ones? Okay, so we're gonna change that one, I'm gonna use a rubber tool. And then we're just gonna add two more windows. No, not like that. Let's go where to go. There we go. Let's can see if I did. Oh, seems fine. So let's make this house. So that is gonna up our net worth a little bit with having more houses and a bigger house, and it also gonna be good living space for my people. So, and we're also gonna make this weaver tool I was talking about. So weaver spindle. We just need one of these bundle of fiber. And one wood. Not sure if we have any fiber yet. We grown these, but you know there are fibers normally all around, so Let's see if we can find any fibers. That is pretty decent close by. It might I don't think there's gonna be any on this mountain. I think we might have to go a little bit further if we're gonna get any. Or we're just gonna have to wait for it grown, so. Yeah, I think we just gonna have to wait. We can get these bears, by the way. So it's gonna take a while for that to grow, so... I'm actually thinking about if we should grow even more of it. Let's make some more of it. 
since we have two farmers now, this is gonna go a little bit faster at least. And I think we're also gonna expand these uh, food stock here. So that's gonna be able to carry a little bit more food. Yeah, I think we yeah we need we need to get wood. We're lacking wood. So let's get away. Some of these trees. I kinda like that tree close by to my town, but at the same time. We need to get trees. I would like to grow those trees on where like wherever I want. Like have one tree here would be pretty good. Not a too big one, but have a tree there, that would be nice. So maybe we should move this one. I think it's uh Feels a bit weird placed. Maybe we can have it like... Let's put it there. That could be pretty good. So what more should we do? So this is growing and we're just waiting for that so we can make that weaver's tool. Here we got some silkweed. I'm not sure we're gonna be able to get it. We might be. So make a ladder so they can actually climb down and get that. And we can get these berries and stuff as well if we want to. We can see if there's anything else we can do here. So we're done with this ingot so we can make something more. I think this, um, yeah, this steel one, they only need iron and coal. I think they maybe have upped so it requires one more coal. I think we was just requiring one coal in the past. I'm sure about it, but uh, I think it was that. So let's make uh, two steel ingots. It doesn't hurt to have some supplies. Let's see. This one needs bronze, and I think this shield. Yeah, the shield needs steel. And we need uh, one bolt of leather for that one. But this weapon, this is really nice too. I mean, we can make, if we make two steel ingots, we can actually make this short sword. And that is actually better than uh, the stone mall. I'll get some error message. Maybe place some more beds. Oh, that was too close. Let's see how to sleep this time. Oh, the man is sleeping in the same bed. I guess it's some bug of this version. It's really strange, it's not that I really care for for the moment, but uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna get fixed in the next patch, so... Let's see how she's doing the footman here. I think I'm gonna alert the other ones because you see this goblin is trying to take our stuff. Oh, footman level 2, congrats. That's good. 10, 10 more in health, that's good. Yeah, sleeping on the stockpile. Done with the goblin fight, just goes to bed directly. <laughs> um, um, okay, so... Oh, we got a weaver spindle. I guess they went down and got it. Yeah, good. So let's get uh, Ilwin into an weaver. Since you only have one normal worker, but other ones, as long as they're not busy, they're gonna come and help with those stuff anyway, so... So let's make a little workshop for this guy. I think it was a guy at least. Wasn't it this guy? Yeah. So we're just getting it down. I actually need one fiber for making the workshop as well. And I guess one wood. Why couldn't he take one wood from here? He'd go and take the supply from uh, the guys that are building the house. Damn him. So I mean, we can queue up some things now. We, we know that we're gonna need this and we're gonna need threads for that. So I'm gonna... Go we're not gonna craft, we're gonna maintain this stuff. Let's always maintain six threads and two bundle of leather, I think that's gonna be enough. And I guess let's make three of uh, bolt of cloth. So I think that's gonna go pretty fast to make that. And I think we got the steel so we can make a sword. Also have this long sword, but see it requires level four. Daily update. What's going on here? Awesome. Panther Vondes has joined. So we're gonna make this short sword 18 damage, and the see long sword. They got actually the same damage. I think that's gonna differ in the end. Maybe it have longer reach, or it just deals a little bit more damage, a little bit slower, maybe. So let's see what's gonna happen once they make the sword. I haven't really seen if they upgrade from the stone mall to the sword, so I hope they will. Let's see what she's gonna do. Yeah, she did. So she dropped the stone mall to get it back. She got a sweet little nice sword, 18 damage. So that is really, really nice. But guys, this is gonna have to be it for today with Stoneheart. And the next one, we're gonna continue and 
improve my footman even more and our town so. Guys, thank for watching, make sure to subscribe if you want to see more Stoneheart and like this video if you like it. Thanks for watching, have a great day, take care.